Governor Andy Bashir continued hammering home the need for Kentuckians to mask up and vax up by pointing to the strains affecting the state's health care system. The governor noted that 66 of the state's 96 hospitals are now facing critical staffing shortages, the highest number yet. And to illustrate the struggles health care workers are facing, he shared the story of one employee at Pikeville Medical Center. They beg for you to call their families. <laughs> they beg for you to tell their families that they love them. <laughs> you know, once they make it to the ICU to get intubated, they're sedated. So whatever they got to say, they got to say before that. Last week, a man told me, you know, we knew we were going that way. We knew it. He had a BiPAP on. He was maxed out on his oxygen on it. We were still, we were dropping. He said, just take it off, let me die. And I begged him, no, 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 not today. Today's not the day. You've got more fight. Today's not the day. We're not going to do it. And so I called his wife. So she talked to him. And he said, okay, I'll do it a little while longer. So his BiPAP was so loud, she couldn't really hear what he was saying. So I said, what do you want me to, what do you want me to tell your wife? Um, he could hear her. She talked to him. Before he hung up, he said, tell her that I love her. I'll be on the ventilator by this evening. Two hours later, unresponsive, put him on the ventilator. Next day, he was made comfort measures on the ventilator, he passed away. That's my every day. Here at Pikeville Medical Center's Heart and Vascular Institute, we have assembled a comprehensive team of cardiac specialists bringing expertise from all regions of the nation and the world. We have coupled that with cutting edge technology, providing them the best equipment and operating rooms available. The result is comprehensive cardiac care for the people of our region that is second to none. The Heart and Vascular Institute at Pikeville Medical Center. Governor Bashir also updated vaccination numbers, which showed a lot of work left to do to get more people under 30 vaccinated. The governor also noted that the age groups below 30 currently have the highest rate of infection in the state.